Today's problem is nice grid. I'm going to show you a problem that looks intimidating at first glance, but has a hidden pattern that will completely change how you approach similar problems. I bet that you can find the pattern in the first 10 seconds. Pause the video, I'll wait for you. You look at the problem and don't know where to start. I get it, I've been there. This black and white grid problem is perfect for your problem solving confidence. Look at the 15 by 15 grid. Our task is simple. Given row R and column C, we need to tell in the grid whether the cell is either black or white. But here's where most programmers panic. Do we need to hard code the entire grid? Should I store it in 2D array? Obviously, there has to be a better way, right? Pause the video right here and take a look at grid for two minutes. What pattern do you notice? What repeats? I'll wait. Did you see it? No? Let me guide your eyes. Look how the pattern forms square inside squares. Notice how the colors alternate. That's where the magic happens. Instead of memorizing the grid into variables, we can use this concentric nature of squares. The key insight is we don't need to store the grid at all. We just need to figure out which layer our given R, C belongs to. The problem that looked like a huge grid can be solved with simple math. Now it's your turn. Pause the video and try implementing the solution. And share your approach on LinkedIn and get insights from everyone in the community. And top performers from T20 DSA Challenge will get exclusive passes of AUDF Day, where you can get direct mentorship from engineers from Apple, Google, Microsoft, and many more fan companies. Don't believe me? Here is what Jaita told about us. See you tomorrow.